name is Justin Langley. I'm from Clinton High School, and this is my prep profile. Uh, Justin, uh, baseball and basketball. Obviously, baseball is your favorite. Yeah. How long have you been playing the game? Um, actually, I've only been playing since about fifth grade. Started a little bit later, but uh, definitely picked it up pretty quickly, I guess. What What do you like about the game? What What fascinates you? Basketball is on a time limit. Baseball is like yeah. forever. Um, well, baseball is just kind of obviously the the pace is a little bit different. Um, just the stuff that goes on, all the stuff that goes on during the game in the dugout, all the just all the, like the little things, I guess. Now you're a four O student, class valedictorian. Congratulations. And you like the mental aspect of the game? Is that something that challenges you too? Yeah, definitely. Baseball is, I'd say it's at least half of it's mentally. You got to prepare yourself every single game, right? even in the game, more than once. Um, definitely tests how mentally strong you are. Uh, over the years, I've definitely uh, gotten a lot more mentally tough just because of baseball. Now you, uh, you've had some pretty good games. Do you have a most memorable moment or two from your high school career? Um, I'd have to say... Uh, the 19 strikeout game I had against um, Turner this year, and I also had four RBIs that game, so um, that doesn't help, it doesn't hurt either. But uh, definitely having a huge game against the uh, big rivals, that's, that's pretty memorable. Now, uh, you, you said you started baseball light. Soccer was actually your first sport what, when you were four? Yeah. How long did you, did you play soccer? Um, I probably played soccer until about seventh grade, probably. Uh, was taken over by the other sports. But it was good while it lasted. And then uh, you also played high school basketball. Did you enjoy that? Had a good experience with that yeah. too? Basketball in high school is like nothing I've ever done before. Um, uh, just like the the team mentality that, that I was on, it was it was crazy. It was like basically we were a family and uh, definitely something I'll never forget. Uh, you look at uh, the different teammates you played. Most inspirational teammate, you said Ryan Scarpetta? Yeah, um, that was, uh, I played with Ryan um, when I was 15, and it was the first year I was playing for an 18U team, the Boys of Summer. And um, I don't know, it just, I tried to like emulate everything that he did, because he, so, he was just such a great player, and just a great person all around, and uh, he definitely um, brought me up a little bit from uh, where I'd been. Uh, favorite team, Chicago Cubs. How tough is it to be a Cubs it fan? It is definitely not easy, ever. Um, every year you go in thinking this might be the year. And about a uh, quarter into the, part of the way into the season, you're just like, oh, man, it's not going to happen. But uh, maybe uh, they'll get one eventually. With uh, Theo Epstein in there now, hopefully some good things will happen. And favorite athlete, Josh Hamilton. What, yeah. uh, did you, uh, this Just this whole story? Yeah, definitely overcoming all the all the hardships that he's had in his life and becoming the player he is now. It's pretty amazing. Yeah, obviously, uh, baseball, is that's where you like to end up? Yeah, definitely. Now, how did you end up at uh, UW-Milwaukee uh, as a recruit? Um, really the first time that I had any uh, contact with any of the coaches, I was at a, a tryout for the Racine hitters. And um, R.J. Fergus introduced me into to one of their coaches, and he's like saying that they uh, showed a little interest in me, so just kind of went from there. And uh, to be able to play at the next level, how important was it for you to keep your baseball career going? It was, it's very important because if not for playing in college, then I wouldn't be able to get to playing professional baseball eventually. Uh, favorite opponent, Boyd Turner? Yeah. Uh, any particular game there, or is it just uh, uh, the school? I mean, every, every game is different. Every game gets really interesting, um, and no matter how good either team is, games always just seem to be close. And it's a favorite place to visit Hawaii. You've been there, but you yeah. want to go to Australia. When were you in Hawaii? Uh, we went for, I think, my parents' 25th wedding anniversary. We went on a cruise there, and it was, it was awesome. So now you want to take it one more step and go a little bit farther to Australia? <laughs> yeah. yeah, maybe one day I'll get there. Um, as far as other activities, just enjoy catching fish with my bare hands. <laughs> What's that about? That might uh, be a little bit on the... Uh, far-fetched side. I've tried it a couple of times. I think I've caught one, one time. So uh, I always tell my friends that I, I'm really good at it, even though I've only done it once. And uh, now are you left-handed? Yeah. But you golf or right or left-handed? Yeah, we've done it a couple of times. It's pretty weird. 
Um, me and my dad got this idea one day that, because we were playing with the rest of the family, to make it fair, we would play the opposite hands. And uh, didn't do too bad. So, okay. so every, every once in a while, go out <laughs> yeah. and do it. Yeah. And then as far as, uh, uh, now this, uh, you played for the boys this summer and the seen hitters, and this summer we're playing for a different team. Yeah. Um, the, the boys this summer, uh, the coach, it's, he, uh, he uh, went to a different team, I think, and he's just helping out with pitching and stuff now. So he referred me to uh, uh, Steve Wiley, and he's the coach of the, the Hurricanes, and they're they're very good. And they, that's McHenry? Yeah. They got, I would say it's one of the best teams in the Midwest, easily. So uh, summer of baseball, and then uh, when do you have to report for school? I don't know yet, actually. Should be getting that. I have... Uh, Freshman orientation coming up soon, so all that should be in there. Now you you haven't played a fall sport, but you play fall baseball. Mm -hmm. What's it going to be like? Are you looking forward to fall baseball from the college level? Yeah, definitely, definitely. Getting uh, looking forward to getting a lot bigger and stronger and seeing seeing what can happen from that. Uh, as far as uh, you got to change anything, I'd be ambidextrous. Yeah. <laughs> what would you like to do? The or uh, is there anything in particular? Um, well. First thing that comes to mind would be baseball, pitching with both hands. Because I know a kid, uh, he's on the Hurricanes. Uh, his name's Ryan Perez. He can, he can actually throw 90 miles an hour with both arms. So seeing that happens, it's pretty uh, makes me pretty jealous of him. So you never know. Huh? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> that, that'd be a good one. But dream date, uh, hard to choose. Megan Fox, Jessica Alba, or Scarlett Johansson. Yeah. Um, I think we could just work it out, and it'd be all four of us just go on one big one big thing that'd be great so i take it you've seen the avengers yeah and oh, what's your what was your uh your uh view or your uh i guess rating of it i it was awesome i think it's definitely uh top three of my favorite movies of all time favorite character um probably iron man because he's i don't know just, just the character yeah. and the personality yeah. of robert downey yeah yeah, it said, you get my news on Twitter. How big are you into the uh, social networking now? Um, I'd say a lot of my battery goes into uh, Twitter and Facebook, so if that answers your question. I'm on Twitter and Facebook all day, so. Now that's where you get news now, isn't <laughs> yeah, it? Yeah, pretty much. Especially for your generation. Perfect day, sleep till noon, play 18 holes of golf, throw no hitter, and watch your dad shave his mustache afterwards. Okay. Do you finally have to, do you have to do that? Uh, no, sadly. I had four or five one hitters this year and uh after the game he'd always come up to me stroking his mustache saying i still got it for one more day so. <laughs> does that continue out of college yeah he said until i'm done playing baseball so okay so we'll what, what no matter what level or does he have no to no matter what okay so we'll have to keep an eye on that one down the road <laughs> yeah and for you um what uh is going to Clinton, what was that like for you, I guess? What are you going to remember most about high school? Um, probably just mo all my friends, um, just the bonds that I've created, and uh, probably the all the records I've broken and all the accomplishments I've made there, mostly. How far a drive is that for you from here? About 10 minutes, so it's not too bad. But... So do um, you think back next year, maybe they get a chance to, uh, you got so close to getting a state? Yeah, I don't know. We'll, uh, I'll definitely be at the game to see what happens. All right. Well, good luck, uh, UW-Milwaukee, and congrats on a great high school career. Thank you.